what is going on everybody ordinary Randy here and today's video is just gonna be kind of a rant slash vent video and the gameplay in the background won't be too serious just kind of going on a whim playing how I play enjoying the game now it's been almost a week I think just about uh, since I have played Warframe but that's okay I'm getting back in the groove of things at the house had to take a couple days off um, just had my a lovely baby boy and uh, the time off felt good but at the same time coming back into it feel a little rusty feel like I don't know what to talk about or what videos to make and it just feels a little off kind of like a writer's block sort of deal and I want to make enter entertaining videos I want to make engaging content but it just seems like a lot of responsibilities coming up and a lot of things to do. So I'll definitely keep making videos because I enjoy making videos, playing games, and being able to do this. And I want to be able to, in the future, do this as a full time thing. Record myself playing and editing putting it up for people to enjoy but the creative block is just weird because having not done it for several days it's just odd same way if you do something you're enjoying for a while whether it be a sport or academics reading after not doing it for a while, when you go back into it, you're like, oh, this is, this is different. I, this is not what I remember. But, I think I'll find my groove back. And I want to make creative content. It's just, the quality content that is expected in today's day and age is, is very demanding. It takes a lot of time, and... And if it's not making you any money, then it's hard to want to be able to do it, or being able to do it. So, at the moment, I'm not making any money from this, so it's just, in a way, a hobby. But I'm hoping this can make me a lot of money so I don't have to work a, a job that I hate, or something I don't want to do with my life. I do think if I continue to do this, it will eventually lead to something. I, I know it will, but it's just about consistency and just finding the time to do it. So my initial goal was to be doing daily content and putting videos out daily because there's a constant demand for something to distract us. Everyone wants that. And I know that going through my YouTube recommended, I honestly don't find any of my videos entertaining anymore. I barely watch the videos it recommends me. It just feels like YouTube is going through a weird stage right now where content is... It's not quality anymore. I remember the good old days when I was it's still in middle school, high school enjoying the videos I watch, but now they just seem like white noise to play in the background. Can't actually sit there and enjoy and watch it anymore. It's it's just hit different. It's I don't I don't know if that's just with aging or if that's with that has to deal with the type of content being put out now. And doing this for a while was fun, but it feels as if I don't have the time anymore, so like I was saying with daily uploads, I was wanting to do that, but 
I believe I'm. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna have to cut back and maybe do three videos a week. Just about. Because in these coming months, I'm gonna be so busy that this is gonna have to be on the back burner. Which is okay. But. If this was making money, I'd not, I'd be able to do this and support my family and enjoy everything. But even if I did that, I think that I'd still have something. I, uh, my main goal at the end of the day is, is to be able to do this and support my family and from there um, I don't have to work a traditional job because it just feels like those type of jobs I don't feel like it's a way to live Life support on the way. because I've had jobs where it just feels like I'm not really doing much right for you're wasting hours away you're giving up precious time and not doing things you actually want to and do to give up hours to make money just to live. And I don't know if it, I don't think anybody wants that. I doubt it. I, I don't know a single person that's content with working and I don't know a single person that wouldn't want to spend time with their family and be able to enjoy life and actually go out and see things, do things without Life having to work activated. and I've been out of the job market for a while now and it's definitely weird and it starts making you feel like you're not really doing much but initially the honeymoon phase of not having a job is it's fun you have more free time to do things but if you don't structure your day out you can feel like you wasted a day away. Oh, this is really hard to multitask. So am I not supposed to go there? Am I supposed to stay here the whole time? I'm so confused. This mission is very confusing. But about being busy, it's... I know that I'm gonna... have to start working here soon and with working I'm not gonna have as much time to do this and I'll be doing something I enjoy doing as well which is coaching coaching I love doing it coaching a sport I love and being able to teach kids how to play a sport that I enjoy that I love is super fun and I'm it's gonna be hard to balance work with coaching and then trying to do YouTube and caring for my kid because I do and I, I'd like to be there for him Extraction is ready. Additional life support has arrived. I do not know what's going on with my internet But this is just a quick rant on trying to, I'll just leave it on this screen. Um, now this video is just kind of let it out that content will be coming and I want to continue to make content, but it just feels good to kind of let this off my chest that I would like to do this, but I'm having a really hard time thinking of content and creating quality content for YouTube because and for people that that watch YouTube because I've always been a YouTube fan more than watching TV shows but YouTube just isn't isn't entertaining anymore videos just aren't don't they don't they aren't entertaining the way they used to be because I'll notice that I'll click a video and then just think to myself damn this is boring and then just leave the app and 
I think some of the best videos is when a person, you kind of get almost a personal connection to the person where you're like, oh, okay, that's a person. Like, it's not just like this, this company or this, uh, this very generic by the book company type video, very, uh, production oriented. It looks like it, like there was multiple people involved and it looks professional. The professional videos, honestly, in my opinion, aren't, aren't enjoyable. Like, um, tech reviews, I used to be super savvy into tech reviews, but watching a tech review now, I could barely sit through it unless it's, uh, Flossie Carter because I, I love his voice and I love him going, watch shoes, calm down. But some other videos like Mr. Who's the Boss, I, um, I, I would always enjoy watching his videos, but I don't know. It just seems like it's so professionally done, which makes it qual a quality video. But for some reason, that's just in my book. It I got to give props where it's due. It's he. It is quality content. It's just not entertaining. Not the same way Flossie Carter's is, but even with his reviews, I'll just kind of skim through, get the gist of a video, and that's it. But that was just a sh short rant. I know it was all over the place, but I just wanted to make a quick video just to put it out there, put something up, because I want to get back in the groove of posting again. So if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment down below. If you didn't enjoy the video, leave a dislike and comment down below what you think I can do to improve. Other than that, have a great day.